How you doing? Hello again. This is the Max Brow channel. And I got another review for you. Um, a very uh, sharp-eyed uh, sort of fan of mine who has been uh, uh, looking at some of my videos. His name is uh, Basetix. Ba no, Basistix? Basis XX. Basist XX. It's B-A-S-S-I-S-T XX. So I guess you pronounce that Basis Double X. Hi, Basis Double X. He noticed uh, in the background this particular beauty. I was sitting back there while he was watching one of my videos. He was asking me how I liked it. So I guess I'll do a review on it. This is the Ibanez ATK series, ATK 300 series base. Uh, very broad sounding. Very nice base, costs in between uh, about three to five hundred, something like that. Uh, it could uh, easily have cost more, uh, six to eight hundred range, maybe in a thousand for some bases that are made just like this, this same quality. Uh, with the preamp and everything in there, one volume knob control, I love these things. Um, um, interesting um, bridge configuration, the bridge is kind of made all in one onto the pickup here or, or or surrounding the pickup here if you can see that that's interesting and um this is a uh this is a maple neck one they also make a uh four string and five string in um rosewood and um what's interesting about this is a lot of the uh the hip-hop artists hip-hop uh bassists that perform with uh hip-hop artists around uh, they they're into this bass. They really like this bass. Uh, this is the hip hop bass, I guess you could say. Um, very nice sound. Just beautiful sounding bass, and doesn't cost you an arm and a leg. Um, what else can I say about it? Uh, I said they made, made four and five string. Here's the headstock Philip looking at. Very nice, man. Very nice, clean roll. Uh, three uh, tone sunburst copy. And uh, you know the um, Ibanez company has always made some great bases, and this is no exception. This has usually the, the bases run a little more moderately thin with very thin uh, bodies and necks but this is uh this is the meat and potatoes man uh, meat and potatoes two-fisted type of bass really rough edge so i guess uh that's why a lot of the hip-hop artists and uh or, uh actually a lot of rock and roll artists like this bass too so um go to your uh local uh music store and uh, check out the Ibanez ATK 300 series bass. Uh, might be something uh, you'd like, something you would enjoy. Check it out, see what you think of it. Goodbye. And, uh, and uh, thanks to uh, Bassist Double X for making a little note, uh, noticing this bass. I was going to do a review eventually, but you reminded me of it. So, thanks a lot. I'll see you later.